The code that reveals the Premier League is determined by a numerical code. Prepare to have your mind blown. I'm going to start with the Everton-Bournemouth game. Everton, the Toffees beat Bournemouth, the Cherries 1-0 and avoided relegation after they ended the season with 12 draws and 18 losses, 1,218 days after Kobe Bryant died. So confirmation here that Everton ended the season with 12 draws and 18 losses and escaped relegation. Confirmation here that Kobe died 1,218 days before Everton escaped relegation. Kobe died 1-2-6-2020, Everton escaped relegation 5-28-2023, and there's 1,218 days between these dates. 12 times 18 equals 216. Bournemouth got their 21st season loss in the league and stayed on six draws. You'll see here, 21st loss of the season in the league, stayed on six draws. 21 times 6 is 126, which is the date in which Kobe Bryant died. And of course, the beast reigns for 1,260 days. 6 times 6 times 6 equals 216, guys. 21 6 is Prince William's birthday. His beloved Aston Villa, the villains, qualified for Europe today. Interesting, eh? So, prior to this game, Everton and Bournemouth last met 6 months and 16 days ago, and 616 is the alternate number of the beast. 616 is also Jurgen Klopp's birthday. And obviously he's the head coach of Liverpool, which is Everton's Merseyside rivals. Everton end the season on 36 points. And 666 is the 36 triangular number. They end on 36 points, guys. Argentina won the 2022 FIFA World Cup on 12-18. 36 years after they last won it, and it was number 10, Messi, who led them to it 36 years after number 10, Maradona, did it back in 1986. Everton avoid relegation by winning 1-0. Look how Di Maria scored after 36 minutes in this World Cup final, which was played on 12-18. Diego Maradona died with 36 days left in the year. Argentina came into this World Cup 36 games undefeated. Lionel Messi wins the World Cup six months and six days before he turns 36. Six times six equals 36. The beast reigns for three years and six months, guys. Interestingly, Brighton ended the season on 12 losses and 18 wins, which I can show you here. 12 losses, 18 wins. They finished six. And their star player is number 10, Alexis McAllister, who won the 2022 FIFA World Cup on 12-18 with Argentina. And Everton recently destroyed Brighton 5-1, which was huge for their survival hopes. Guys, Brighton went to Goodison Park and beat them 4-1. And then Everton, who were really struggling, go to the Amex and beat Brighton, who were doing really well, 5-1. It makes no sense, does it? But what does make sense is why... 6th place Brighton played 7th place Villa today because 6 times 7 equals 42 and the beast reigns for 42 months. Miami-based 777 partners have been linked with purchasing a stake in Everton. Leo Messi, whose nickname is the Messiah, won the 2022 FIFA World Cup after scoring 7 goals in 7 games and he won the World Cup seven days before Christmas Day. Christmas Day falls on 1225. 35 times 35 equals 1225. And Messi won the World Cup at age 35. Messi is a false messiah. Okay? It's idol worship, guys. We've got to stop worshipping these false prophets, guys. It's one of the biggest goals of my work. Like, how did Mbappe, guys, get two goals in one minute? in the World Cup final. He was the first player in 56 years to score a hat-trick in a World Cup final and he ended 2022 with 56 goals in 56 games. 
And this World Cup, guys, was played 56 years after the Church of Satan was founded. It was founded in 66, which was the year England won the World Cup final against Germany, 4-2. They were wearing red. Number six, Bobby Moore, led them to the World Cup in 66. There's your 666. Six goals were scored. Number 10, Jeff Hurst, was the hero, scoring a hat-trick, guys. Abdullahi Dekore wears number 16 for Everton. And he was the hero for them today after he scored the winning goal that kept them in the league. And the season ended exactly 53 weeks after Man City won the 2021-2022 Premier League season. In dramatic fashion where they beat Aston Villa 3-2 in the last game of the season. Steven Gerrard's Aston Villa guys. 53 is the 16th prime number so it made complete sense. Italy won Euro 2020 to win their first Euros in 53 years. And Euro 2020 was the 16th edition of the Euros. The first goal scored in Euro 2020 was in Italy's game against Turkey. It was scored after 53 minutes. And the three players that missed penalties for England in the Euro 2020 final penalty shootout against Italy were Rashford, Sancho and Saka. The jersey numbers in this game were 11, 17 and 25 and 11 plus 17 plus 25 equals 53. Elizabeth was coronated in 53. So that's pretty remarkable. It makes sense, doesn't it, that we live in a coded reality how Italy can win the Euros and then not qualify for the World Cup shortly after by getting knocked out by Macedonia. Go check what score that game finished. So, I came across this on Twitter. 1,073. Abdullahi Dekuri has scored the 1,073rd goal of the 2022-23 Premier League. The most ever scored in a single 20-team season in the competition, surpassing 2018-19's 1,072. Gluttony. Gluttony is one of the seven deadly sins, by the way. But it was the 173 that caught my eye. Caught my eye, guys. Because Decore scored the goal that kept Evan in the league after 57 minutes. All right? And that connects to Super Bowl 57, which I'll get to later. Argentina won the 2022 FIFA World Cup final in their coach's 57th game. Ex-Chelsea Academy player and Bayern's current number 42, Jamal Musiala, scored Bayern's winning goal to win them their 11th straight title and he was born on the 57th day of the year in 2003, exactly 10 years after the 1993 World Trade Center bombings. German Jürgen Klopp finished 5th in his 7th season with Liverpool. Kansas City Chiefs won Super Bowl 57, which was 57 days after Pope Francis's birthday. Remember, Argentina won the World Cup a day after Pope Francis's 86th birthday. And he's Argentinian. And Argentina last won the World Cup in 86 with Maradona. So Chiefs won Super Bowl 57 by beating the Eagles, 38-35. And they ended the season with a 17-3 record. So it makes sense that Decore got this 1,073rd goal in this season's Premier League. 17 times 3 is 51 as well, and Everton beat Brighton 5-1 earlier in the season. 5 ones when the Illuminati were founded. England beat Germany 5-1 10 days before 9-11. They did that in Bavaria, where the Illuminati were founded, May the 1st. Just incredible stuff. And if you look here, if you want to see another 51, guys, I will give you another 51. Leicester went down having scored 51 goals this season in the league. So Leicester won the Premier League in 2016, guys, where there were 5,000 to 1 to do so. We told it was a miracle. It was just their code. And they've just been relegated exactly 367 weeks after the 2015-2016 season concluded. 367, guys, is the 73rd prime number. My amazing dad sent me a message yesterday telling me that he scored 
Four goals in his team's 7-3 win at Bradford City Stadium Valley Parade. I'm telling you guys, it's crazy how connected I am with this code. 73 is the 21st prime number and Leicester won their last game of the season this season 2-1 at the King Power Stadium versus West Ham United. The Hammers, guys. Their logo looks like Skull and Bones. It looks like Tampa Bay Buccaneers logo where Brady went 7-3 and in Super Bowls in the 21st year of the 21st century and then retired on 2-1. But this 2-1 win for Leicester, it wasn't enough, was it? Because they got relegated. Leicester get relegated the year King Charles is coronated. They play at the King Power Stadium. And Man City beat Leeds 2-1 on the day King Charles III was coronated and Erling Haaland was born in Leeds in 2000 and City just won their third straight title. We live in a coded reality, guys. We really do. We really, really do. Erling Haaland born 21-7. And this season's Premier League ends on a day leaving 217 days left in the year. And he's the Golden Boot winner. And he was born on that date. 21-7. Erling Haaland born 21-7. 21-7. The guy who wins the golden boot was born on 21-7 and he wins the league with Man City in a league season that ends with 217 days left in the year. 217 is also Michael Jordan's birthday, the GOAT. Okay? Jordan sponsor Paris Saint-Germain. Messi just got the goal that ensured PSG won the league in France. Leicester won the league in 2016 soon after King Richard's body was found in Leicester and now they get relegated when King Charles was crowned king. Really? King Richard, Jamie Vardy's middle name is Richard. We know all about Vardy in that 2016 season. The guy who went from non-league to one of the best strikers in world football of his code Queen equals 73 and she was married for 73 years and she got married at age 21 George Bush and Barbara Bush were married for 73 years and their son was the president during 9-11 and Queen Elizabeth died 911 days after coronavirus was declared a global pandemic Leicester get relegated with 34 points and 9 wins. 34, the ninth Fibonacci number. Interesting. Very interesting. 34 is the ninth Fibonacci number and they had previously spent 9 consecutive seasons in the Premier League. And then number 9, Jamie Vardy, guided them to the Premier League title in 2016. Jamie Vardy, number 9, scored in 11 consecutive games that season in the Premier League. Broke a record, 9-11. Leicester won the Premier League in 2016, ending on 81 points. The year Kobe retired from the NBA, 5-7 and seven in NBA Finals. Leicester City and Gematria equals 81. Claudio Ranieri, the Italian, coached Leicester to their only Premier League title and he was sacked by Leicester City after 81 games in charge. How can he win the league with them, guys, and then get fired shortly after? It's like Tuchel, he won the Champions League with Chelsea and then he gets fired. Kobe's highest scoring game was 81 points and he achieved this in his 666 career game. The Lakers just knocked out the Warriors recently in the NBA where Steph Curry stayed on 666 career wins. He became 4-2 in NBA Finals in 2022 and he did that on 616. 616, the alternate number of the Beast. The Beast reigns for 42 months. It's going on everywhere guys when you understand the code you see that 666 is the 36 triangular number Everton stay up after finishing on 36 points Erling Haaland wins the 2022-2023 golden boot scoring 36 goals before the season began I coded Haaland to be the golden boot winner and I said he'll likely end with 42 goals or 36 goals everyone on my website can back that up he ended on 36 goals okay he ended on 36 goals. 
The beast reigns for three years and six months. Kobe's 81-point game was in 2006, the year his daughter Gianna Bryant was born, who died with him in the helicopter crash. That game was 10 years before he retired and Leicester won the league, and Everton stay up after winning the game 1-0 due to a 57th-minute winner in a game that had 10 minutes added time. And remember, Kobe retired 5-7 and seven in NBA Finals. The Chiefs were down 10 points at half-time during Super Bowl 57 to Kobe's Philadelphia Eagles and the 2022-2023 Premier League season began at the home stadium of the Eagles' Crystal Palace in a game where Arsenal won. Leicester won the Premier League in 2016 10 points ahead of second-place Arsenal who finished second 5 points behind Man City this season. Queen Elizabeth supported Arsenal, so did her mother, Arsenal are the only team that have been welcomed to Buckingham Palace for tea. The Invincibles. Phil Foden ended with 10 Premier League goals this season. Phil Foden, number 47. He replaced David Silva in Man City's starting lineup. Silva, guys, the atomic number for Silva is 47. So, of course, he replaces David Silva. Leicester have won the FA Cup once, guys, and they did that by beating Thomas to Shell's Chelsea 1-0. And Brendan Rodgers was coaching Leicester. Rodgers born on 1-2-6. Leicester City win the FA Cup final five years after the 2016 Premier League season ended. A season in which they were crowned champions against all odds. 2016 is when Trump became the president. And I believe Trump will become the 47th US president. Which makes sense why the Premier League season ended on number 47 Phil Foden's birthday. The 2022-2023 Premier League season ended on Man City and England stars Kyle Walker, John Stones and Phil Foden's birthdays. Kyle Walker turned 33 today, John Stones turned 29, Phil Foden turned 23. 33 plus 29 plus 23 equals 85 and the 2022-2023 Premier League season began on 8-5 in the game between Arsenal and Crystal Palace, like Buckingham Palace, their nicknames the Eagles, and... The Premier League season ended today on Walker, Stones and Foden's birthday. They all play for the three Lions. These three Man City and England internationals, the three Lions, were born on 528. That's the 32nd triangular number, by the way. Man City won the league last season by beating Aston Villa 3-2 on the last game of the season. They won their first Premier League title due to a 3-2 win against Queen's Park Rangers in a game where Aguero was the hero. Just, wow. How can Kyle Walker, John Stones and Foden all play for Man City and England and all be born on 5-2-8? Playing for a team that has next to no England internationals is Walker, there's Stones, there's Foden, there's Grealish. Ask yourself how that is possible if we're not living in a coded reality. Kobe was inducted into the NBA Hall of Fame exactly five years after the 2015-2016 Premier League season ended and Walker Stones and Foden have now all won five Premier League titles with Pep. 23-year-old Foden's won five Premier League titles and Kobe Bryant was born on the 235th day of the year. Ranieri was hired by Leicester in 2015 on 13-7, the 13th of July. 137 is the 33rd prime. In the last game of the 2022-2023 Premier League season, had 33 goals scored. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final ended 3-3 after extra time. Sergio Aguero retired on Diego Maradona's 61st birthday at age 33. Man City end the season with a goal difference of plus 61. 33 goals against. 89 points, the Queen died on 8-9. The World Cup lasted 28 days. Man City end with 28 season wins on the 28th day of May. Napoli win their first league title in 33 years and they achieve this in their 33rd league game of the season and they play at the Diego Armando Maradona Stadium. Ranieri's managerial debut with the club came in a 4-2 win over Sunderland and the beast reigns for 42 months. So Everton finished 17th in the league. Leicester City get relegated with a minus 17 goal differential. 
17 is the seventh prime. Leicester get relegated seven years after they won the Premier League. They finish on seven draws for the season. Guys, Leicester's squad in 2016 wasn't as good as their current squad. You've got to be asking these questions now. Man City just won their seventh Premier League title. Riyad Mahrez plays for Man City and he of course won the league with Leicester wearing the number 26 jersey and he's just won the league yet again with Man City wearing number 26. He's the most decorated African footballer in Premier League history. He scored for Leicester versus Man City during their... He scored for Leicester versus Man City during their league winning campaign in 2016. He did that on 2-6. All right, in their 3 1 shock win. He did it on the anniversary of Queen Elizabeth becoming the Queen. She became the Queen in 52. 5 plus 2 is 7. So, Queen equals 26. She was born in 26. She became the Queen on 2 6. She died two months and six days before King Charles's birthday. She died 101 days before the 2022 FIFA World Cup final and 101's a 26 prime. Just know her mother died at age 101. Messi won the World Cup final 101 days after the Queen died in his 26 World Cup appearance. England were knocked out of the 2022 FIFA World Cup on Cincinnati Bengal QB's Joe Burrow's 26th birthday. And Cincinnati is the Queen City. And Joe Burrow lost Super Bowl 56 2023. Leicester just got relegated in 2023. Man City just won the league in 2023. Just insanity. England got knocked out of the FIFA World Cup by a goal from Olivier Giroud exactly 42 weeks before his birthday and Giroud just got the winning goal today for AC Milan in their 1-0 win to guarantee Champions League football. Olivier Giroud, guys, his numbers are insane. He obviously replaced Benzema for France in the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Benzema was the first player in 42 years to win the Ballon d'Or and not appear at the World Cup. Remember that France and Giroud won the 2018 World Cup Final 4-2 versus number 10 Modric's Croatia. Kobe Bryant died in 2020 on 126 in a helicopter crash that killed nine people. Leicester's owner died in a helicopter crash shortly after. Leicester won the league, didn't they, with 81 points, which is nine times nine. The 2015-2016 Premier League season ended four weeks and four days after Kobe Bryant retired. Leicester's owner was born on 4-4 and he had four children. Haaland ended the Premier League season with 44 goal involvements to match Thierry Henry's record of 44. Interesting how Liverpool drew 4-4 versus the Saints in their last game of the Premier League season. The UK dialing code is plus 4-4. Queen Elizabeth had four children. A jubilee lasted four days. The United Kingdom's made up of four countries. It's interesting how four days is 96 hours. The Queen died at age 96, like I predicted when she was 94. I've got a book about it if you're interested. Check the link in the description. Thomas Tuchel was hired by Chelsea in 2021, exactly 12 months after Kobe died. All right. And shortly after, he won the Champions League final versus Pep and Man City, where Chelsea won that final 1 0, like 10. Tuchel lost the 2020 Champions League final 1 0 versus his current team, Bayern Munich due to a Kingsley Coleman goal, and that was on Kobe Bryant's 42nd birthday, and 1,260 days is 42 months. Kingsley Coleman got a very important goal for Tuchel's Bayern Munich on their way to winning the Bundesliga again. Did you know this, guys? In 2018, Jurgen Klopp was in the Champions League final, where his Liverpool lost to Real Madrid, where Gareth Bale was the star player. All right? 2019, Liverpool beat Tottenham in the Champions League final. Klopp is there yet again. 2020, Tuchel is in the Champions League final, coaching Paris Saint-Germain in a 1-0 loss to Bayern Munich. 2021, Tuchel is in the Champions League final for Chelsea, winning 1-0 against Guardiola's Man City. 2022, Klopp is in the Champions League final, again losing 1-0 to Ancelotti's Real Madrid. So the last five Champions League finals, Klopp and Tuchel have been a part of them. Both German. I keep talking about war. 
makes you think, doesn't it? If Tuchel's such a great coach, then why did Chelsea get rid of him? Because it's all coded. This code's the best code you'll ever see to show that. Kingsley Coleman, guys. He's won the league every season since becoming a pro. 11 out of 11. He wears number 11. Bayern Munich just won the league with their 89th minute goal from their number 42. And 89's the 11th Fibonacci number. It looked like Bayern were going to blow the league by drawing 1-1, like 11. But no, they popped up and won 2-1. So Guardiola just won the 2022-2023 Premier League season exactly 12 years after winning the 2011 Champions League final 3-1 versus Manchester United. 2011, guys. The 2022 FIFA World Cup began on 2011, the 20th of November on Joe Biden's 80th birthday. Lionel Messi was awarded the man of the match and he guided Argentina to the 2022 FIFA World Cup where they won the final 4-2 on penalties versus France. 20 plus 22 equals 42, and Argentina were awarded $42 million for winning the final. Pep ended the 2022-2023 season with a 1-0 loss to Brentford, and he ended on 1,930 all-time points as a coach, and the first ever World Cup final was played in 1930, where Uruguay defeated Argentina 4-2 in the final. Notice both Uruguay and Argentina wear sky blue, like Man City, like Napoli. Leicester are relegated 1,218 days after Kobe died and the 2022 FIFA World Cup final was won by Messi and Argentina on 12-18. I've shown you how Leicester are heavily connected to Kobe Bryant. Man City win the league the day Leicester are relegated and they do this on a day leaving exactly 31 weeks left in the year and this is the 31st Premier League season. It's also the 31st edition of the Champions League final and Man City are in the final against Inter Milan. Luton just got promoted to the top flight for the first time in 31 years after beating the Sky Blues Coventry on penalties. That finished 5-6 on penalties. Charles coronated on 5-6. In this game, the opening goal was scored after 23 minutes and then the decisive penalty was missed by Coventry's number 23. All right, Luton scored after 23 minutes. Coventry scored after 66. 23 plus 66 equals 89. The date the Queen died, how many points Man City won the league with. 89, the 11th Fibonacci number. This final between Coventry and Luton finished 1-1, didn't it? 31's the 11th prime and Decore kept Everton in the league with his winning goal and he was born on 1-1, like 11. Jamie Vardy was born on the 11th day of the year on 1-1-1. Queen Elizabeth born the 111th day of the year. 9-11 occurred on a day leaving 111 days left in the year. And he broke the record for the most consecutive games in the Premier League scoring. He went 11 games in a row scoring, guys. The guy born the 11th day of the year. Another 11 for you. Brendan Rodgers began the season as Leicester's head coach and he was fired and he was born in 73 on 126. 73. Leicester get relegated exactly 367 weeks after the 2016 Premier League season ended. 73rd prime. Brendan Rodgers born in 73 on 126. Jose Mourinho is Chelsea's greatest ever coach and he was born exactly 10 years before Rodgers in 1963 on 126 and Rodgers coached at Chelsea with their reserves. You've got Jose Mourinho in the Europa League final for Roma and Guardiola in the Champions League final for Man City. Two of the greatest coaches of all time. Mourinho born 126, the beast reigns for 1,260 days. You've got Guardiola born 18-1, 1-8-1, the 42nd prime. The beast reigns for 42 months. The six days between the birthday, Satan's number. is always one level below God, guys. It's God's number seven, the devil's number six. Why are you six times seven's 42? Man City won the 2022-23 league on Phil Foden's 23rd birthday. Leicester won the 2015-2016 league title, winning 23 games. 23 is the ninth prime. Man City win their ninth league title. Number nine, Erling Haaland wins the golden boot. 2-3-9 is the 52nd prime. Pep has won five Premier League titles and failed to win it on two occasions. Kobe won five NBA finals and lost two. Queen Elizabeth became the queen in 52. It all makes sense now why Leicester went to the Etihad in 2020, the year Kobe died, and shocked the world by beating Man City 5-2 in a game where Vardy scored three, and Mahrez scored the opening goal for Man City after 
four minutes. The Beast of Revelation, guys, the four horsemen. You've got to read about it. Guardiola wins his 11th title in 14 years, and King Charles was born on 11-14. Really? I'll say that again. Guardiola, the GOAT, wins his 11th title in 14 years, and King Charles was born on 11-14. And remember, Man City beat Leeds the day that King Charles was coronated on 5-6. Man City have now won five out of the last six Premier League titles. The code right here should be enough to make anyone question their reality. I'm one in a million when it comes to this. I am. And if this code doesn't wake you up, what more do you want? This sums everything up that I've been doing for three years. All right. So there you have it. What are you going to do with this knowledge? Are we going to continue to dismiss it? Or are we going to embrace it and try and figure out what this is all about? It's definitely a spiritual war between God and the devil. Whose side are you on, guys? God or the devil because I've picked my team and I know that God wins and I'm on that team. Much love. Take care. Please share my work. Please support my work and God bless you all. God wins.